Hello basketball coaches and basketball players. Today on this channel, I'm going to talk to you about how you can shoot a better three-point shot. On this channel, I'll show you basketball plays, drills, and skills. So if you like that stuff, hit that like button and subscribe. But anyways, today we're going to be going out to the three-point line. I'm going to give, give you some of my tips on how I shoot the three-point shot so well and how others shoot really well as well. Now, out on the three-point line, obviously you're going to need more strength. It's a lot farther from the basket. The reason for this is because, well, you're far. And what you're gonna need to do, number one, is to know how you shoot. So, what I mean by that is a little tip that I always like to give my players is to get to know your shot form. And what I mean by that is to stay three to four feet away from the rim and get your shot down. And get to know your shot, what it feels like. What it feels like to get the ball in. So, if you're coming out to the three point line and you're shooting a shot and you can feel that your elbow's a little too far wide and that's why it's going right, that kind of thing, you can mentally make your shot better back to how it was when you were only three to four feet away from the rim. Now, another tip that I like to give my players is if your shot is short, you're going to need more legs, which means that you're gonna to need to jump a lot higher on your shot to get more power to get it to the rim. And then if it's too far, let's say you're shooting over the backboard or you're clanking it off the back of the rim, then what you need to do is get more arc on your shot. And to do that, all you're gonna to need to do is reach up a lot higher on your shot instead of reaching a lot more forward. The higher you reach, the higher that arc is going to be. And that's going to allow you to really perfect your shot in the middle of the game. So for one, if you're missing a lot of threes when you normally make them, you're gonna come back and then say, what did that shot form feel like? Did it feel off? And then if it does, you're gonna correct in the middle of the game what your shot actually should feel like. And then, if you're still too far, but you're on line, but you're too far or you're too short, then you're gonna be using more legs or more arc. And if you're using more arc, you're gonna need more legs because it's not gonna go as far. Now, if you're a point guard and you've got a lot of really good shooters on your team, the one tip I can give you is to learn how your teammates like to shoot the ball. So for me, I used to like to really break down my defender so that he's not really moving that much and then just pull up for a shot right in his face or I like to get it in the corners off of somebody driving and then I would jack up the shot because they would draw the double team because they're driving towards the rim, which would allow me to be wide open. I also used to like it when players in the post, I used to feed them and then I used to cut down and then I used to cut down towards that low corner, get that pass back and take a shot from the deep corner. So as a player who's shooting the ball, you really need to know where you shoot the best and try and get in those spots so that you can be more successful. So now with those tips, let's see if I can take a better three-point shot. So in high school, on the actual high school level, it was about a 35% three-point shooter. When I got into AAU in grade 12, I was more closer to like the 50-60% range. So that gives us a little bit of a, a little bit, a bit of a background to my shot. Now coming up, what I want to do, right foot a little bit in front of the other, just like any other basic shooting form. You want to be able to have your right foot a little bit in front of your left so you get more power. You want to bend your legs, have your knees bend straight, as straight as you can towards the basket. You want to have this part of your arm straight up in the air and your elbow pointing towards the rim. So if you were the rim right now, you would actually be having your my arm pointing, or my, my elbow pointing towards you. Or I should say this part of your, your arm pointing towards the rim. And this being straight up will allow you to have a straight shot. Now, let's see. We're gonna take a shot. I have no idea if I'm gonna make this or miss this. But if I miss this, I know what I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be explain what I need to do to fix what I just screwed up on. If I get it in, I get it in. So I was a little bit left. So the reason why I was a little bit left is because I pulled my elbow a little too far in and that allowed me to push it a little bit too far left. I also felt it come off of my pointer finger, which will allow it to go left as well. I also never got that much arc on it. So 
that didn't exactly help it to go in. So again, I got a little bit more arc on it, but I can still feel it coming off of this pointer finger. So we're gonna try and correct that. So there you have it, that's my shot. And that's how you can correct your shot in game so that you can shoot better three point shots. I hope that you have enjoyed today's video. If you have, hit that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you guys again tomorrow for another daily basketball video.